Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing another clothing haul. Uh, it's going to be mostly pretty little thing pieces but I have got a few Shein pieces to throw in at the end. Before I start off with the clothes I thought I would show you these hoop earrings. Um, I got them in the post today, they're from ASOS. I like gold twisted rope hoops, just little ones. Um, and they were £6 so I just thought I'd mention that. Okay, so the first thing that I got from Pretty Little Thing was this pink check shirt. Um, it's like an oversized fit. As you can see, it's how big the sleeves come to me. Um, it kind of goes past my bum, sort of mid-thigh. Um, it was £25. Did I say that it comes in one size? It comes in one size. It's like a fleecy, just sort of regular flannel material. Um, I'm going to stand up so you can see it better. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Oh, I've just got one button done up because I'm just wearing like uh, a bralette and shorts from Pretty Little Thing as well which I'm going to show you but yeah it's pretty long, pretty big and baggy like I said the arms are pretty long on me and I have actually relatively long arms Um, really comfortable you could throw it over pretty much anything or you could like tie it up if you wanted to just a very easy piece to wear too hot for the weather today Okay, so the next three things that I got from Pretty Little Thing are all sort of related. They're all this like black ribbed soft material. I think they're clusters underwear or loungewear. They're kind of like skims in that sense. I think they were all £7 and I got them in a medium. Preference, I'm mostly a 10, like an 8 to 10. So the first things is like, it's like a thong like a big comfortable thong that comes up pretty high and then I have the uh, black bralette on it's just got like thick straps and the cycling shorts I'll step back and show you what these look like okay so this is what the cycling shorts and the bralette look like um, they're pretty short they just come under the bum they're sort of like a boxer style um, very soft not sure if you could wear them out the house, it's up to you I suppose if you wanted to. Um, they're sort of more of a lounge about kind of thing but I suppose you could wear them under something like this and maybe some trainers just out and about or like how I had it before with just one button done up so you can see it a little bit. Okay so the next thing that I got is this yellow frilly ribbed crop top. Um, I got this in a medium and I think it was £15. I Probably should have got it in a small because it was a bit too big. I'm hoping that it'll shrink a little bit in the wash. But um, it's not too bad. I can just about get away with it. But yeah, runs I'd say a little bit big. So if you're between sizes, maybe size down. Um, and I'll pop this on and show you. Okay, so this is the yellow top on. As you can see, it is a bit big for me. But I could probably still get away with it. I think maybe I'd have to safety pin there a little bit but I probably wouldn't wear a bra with this in person anyway because it's not see-through in person. Oh by the way this also came in other colours, uh, baby pink, baby blue and like a stone beige colour as well if you're interested but I think this was some jeans or denim shorts, it could be really cute. Okay so the next thing that I picked up from Pretty Little Things is another pair of shorts, it's these like cream ribbed boxer style shorts again sort of a skims dupe it's got like a v like real boxes um these are kind of see-through though so i'm not going to be trying them on but you can just wear them about the house and they look pretty cute and they're comfortable again that soft sort of rib material not as stretchy as the black ones though just to bear that in mind um so if you're between sizes again i'd go up a size in these so I got mine in a UK 10 and I think these were £10 as well. Okay, so this next piece, to be honest, I've basically bought all tops here, aside from the two pairs of shorts, but this next piece is going to be... Oh God. Right, let me try and tie this together so I can show you better. Right, so it's like a... Baby pink, again ribbed, apparently everything's ribbed these days, but baby pink, long sleeve crop top. I'm not going to try this on because it's pretty see-through, um, 
I'll probably have to find some sort of bralette to wear so I can wear this actually out. Um, but this was £12 and a size 10. Again, really cute, pastel themed, like pretty much everything in this haul. Okay, the next top is this stone. I think they called it stone, but to be honest, it looks more camel tan to me. Uh, another cardigan. Uh, button front. And yeah, this is kind of too thick to wear in summer. You're probably better off spring or when it's not blazing hot like it has been this week. But you could get away with this with jeans or I reckon you could wear this to work as well. This was £15 and I think a size medium. Basically everything is a medium or a size 10 pretty much except the t-shirt dress that I've got. And then I picked this up in another colour as well but I'll show you this on first. So this is the top on or cardigan. It kind of hits my hip bones so that's why I said you could probably wear it with a pair of like smart trousers as well. I love how long the sleeves are like when they come to like part way up your hand. I love that it's really comfy, again a ribbed material and pretty affordable. You could also wear this sort of unbuttoned and open maybe with like a, sorry there's a motorbike going past, maybe with like a white crop top or something underneath, the same as the next one I'm going to show you which is the colour on the next one. It's so beautiful. Okay so I've just popped the next top on since it was the same as the one before. It's in this gorgeous sage green colour. I am obsessed with green. I feel like it really complements like brown features. But this sage green is just stunning. I've already taken like a few Instagram pictures on this at least. And yeah, just beautiful. Okay, so the last pretty little thing piece I've got is the uh, t-shirt dress that I mentioned before. It says it was £13, so whether it was on sale, because Pretty Little Thing have sales all the time or not, I don't know, because £13 seems like a kind of weird price, but I actually got this in an 8 because it said it was oversized and I didn't want it to drown me, but it's like a nudie white tie-dye t-shirt dress. Uh, tie-dye is everywhere at the moment, and I love a t-shirt dress in the summer, because your legs don't stick together and sometimes denim can be too thick for the heat and you can just chuck them on especially when you're on holiday. A t-shirt dress is an absolute must. Okay so I've still got the shorts on that I was wearing before but you wouldn't probably wear <laughs> black shorts underneath I feel like you can kind of see them but yeah if you just wear nude underwear you'll be fine but this is what it looks like you can just about see where it ends in sort of Mid thigh for me, not too short, not too long, nice and oversized but again, doesn't drown me. Really comfortable and lightweight. If I got makeup on the colour, it's because I'm alone and my boyfriend always helps me to put on clothes when I have makeup on. But there you go, might have to wash it, but hopefully, because it's like this sand colour, it would blend in anyway. But yeah, so this is the last piece from Pretty Little Thing and then I've got three pieces from Shein to show you as well. Okay so the last three things that I've got to show you are all... <clears throat> okay so the last three things that I've got to show you are all tops from Shein or Sheen, I don't know how you say it, but yeah the first one is this top, it's like a fuzzy material if you can see. Um, it's pink and orange colour block. I think it's really cute. Emma Ledger wore a similar top. I'm sure hers was a lot more expensive. But um, I just think it's really cute. It's kind of one of those materials that when you wash it and dry it, you kind of have to resize it again. Because I've just got mine off the air. And so yeah, you kind of have to like pull it and stretch it again. This comes in one size as well. So I don't know how that would work because I feel like if you were size up for me, you probably wouldn't be able to fit into it because it's like kind of just about fits me. Um, and I'm a 10, so yeah, that's kind of annoying. But it's really soft and comfy. I wore this to a picnic, well, a socially distanced picnic uh, a few weeks ago. 
And yeah, I feel like you could probably get away with this in like autumn and summer as well because it's like a thicker material. It was probably too hot for the picnic the other day. I was sweating, to say the least. Uh, and this was $17.99 it says, but there's always discounts on the Shein, so I don't think I paid that much, but yeah, still cheap and cute for a nice top. If I look in a different position to where I was before, it's because I've had to change the battery, which is like the third time I've had to change it for this video. It's just really not been my day, but this is the next top. It's like this vibrant, like, I don't know, like Palmer Violet colour. The lilac-y purple, it's got the ruffles, kind of like the yellow one from before, but it's got more buttons so it's a bit more covered up. I saw this on Jordan Lipscomb's uh, Shein video. It's really cute, again, jeans, skirt, shorts, lovely. Um, let me just check the price. So I got it in a medium and it was 16 49 again. I had a discount but I can't remember what it was so a bit cheaper than that, like £15 probably. Yeah again, ribbed, who shocked but I love the colour on this, it's pretty vibrant, it's not quite a pastel lilac. Um, again like I'd wear everything else, just jeans, skirts, shorts. Okay so this top is the last thing in the haul, it's this like floral ruched. I guess, sort of crepey style, like a bandeau with a one shoulder thing. I need to kind of like steam this ruffle down because it keeps popping back up again. Asymmetric has got this like, I don't know what fabric this is, like um, like ski trousers almost. But yeah, really cute. I feel like this will look really nice with maybe some like big like wide leg jeans or something, some little white heels um, for like dinner and drinks, someone's birthday or something, I think I knocked my bun out putting it over my head but I'm trying to rush through this part of the video because my neighbours keep shouting which is lovely but yeah it's really cute, this ruching material reminds me of being little, I feel like all the dresses <laughs> were made out of this ruchy fabric but yeah, cute. I don't own anything like it at all. Very pretty and yeah, different. What was this? I think this was in a medium as well. Um, yeah, medium and 15.49. Yeah, it fits really nicely. The quality of it's really nice. All of the things that I bought from Sheen are really nice. I'd say, I was going to say maybe size up with the pink and orange top but you can't because it's one size just yeah maybe pull it out when you wash it to help uh, let it keep its shape um, and yeah just be aware of the sizing on that one but I loved all of the things okay so that's all for today's video um, I hope that you saw something that you liked it was a pretty colourful haul a lot more colourful than I normally am but I'm just really liking it I feel like a lot of the ribbed like frilly tops were giving me Pinterest vibes that that's what my whole Pinterest board looks like right now um and yeah just it's nice to add some tops to my collection because I feel like that's the thing I'm always missing is like you know jeans and a nice top not like I have anywhere to go to but things are opening soon so maybe some point in the future jeans and a nice top will actually have some nice tops to make that combo for a change but yeah thank you so much for watching um please subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you in my next video